blue whales, a magnificent creature gracefully gliding through the ocean depths, have fascinated us for centuries. However, despite its breathtaking beauty, myths and misconceptions have become woven into our perceptions. Throughout history, these creatures have been revered as legends, gods, and deities in various tribes, cultures, and mythologies. Today, we'll delve into these fascinating stories and separate myths from the facts. So grab your life jacket and let's start this nautical adventure with nautical depths. But before we start, hit the subscribe button and let us get started. Blue whales are known for their lengthy and slim bodies. Their color is a mix of blue and gray, appearing light blue when they swim underwater, giving them the name blue whale. These animals have a varied pattern of spots on their skin, which can be used to tell them apart. The Antarctic blue whales are typically bigger than other types of blue whales. In places like the North Atlantic and North Pacific, blue whales can be around 90 feet long and weigh over 100,000 pounds. However, in the Antarctic, they can reach up to approximately 110 feet and weigh more than 330,000 pounds. Similar to many baleen whales, female blue whales are generally larger than males. The blue whale holds the title for being the biggest animal ever known to exist. Some old sea creatures and an ancient whale called Perusidus might have been as large, but these estimates are uncertain due to incomplete remains and recent discoveries. The International Whaling Commission, IWC database, notes 88 whales longer than 30 meters, but there are issues with the measurements. The longest scientifically measured blue whale was 30 meters. Models suggest a blue whale can't exceed 33 meters due to metabolic constraints. However, this amazing creature can easily reach an impressive length of 99 feet. These marine animals inhabit oceans worldwide and may weigh over 200 tons. To put it in perspective, a blue whale's tongue alone is heavier than an elephant. Its heart is not only the largest organ in its body, but one of the biggest in the entire animal kingdom. When fully grown, this colossal organ can weigh up to 1,300 pounds and measure an astonishing 12 feet in length. Blue whales are often seen swimming alone or with a friend, though sometimes they hang out in small groups. In the summer, they prefer the chilly polar waters for feeding, but as winter comes, they embark on long journeys to warmer equatorial waters. While munching on food or traveling, blue whales usually cruise at a speed of about five miles per hour. However, when they want to speed up, they can zoom to over 20 miles per hour for short bursts. These massive creatures are super noisy, making pulses, groans, and moans. Interestingly, their sounds can travel really far, up to a thousand miles in the right conditions. Scientists believe they use these sounds to talk to each other and maybe even to navigate in the dark ocean. Blue whales mostly chow down on krill which are like tiny shrimp. Occasionally, they might snack on fish and copepods, which are tiny crustaceans. When it's time to eat, blue whales swim with their mouths wide open towards big groups of krill. They then close their mouths, puff up their throat pleats, and push out the water, leaving the krill trapped inside with the help of their baleen plates. Blue whales live in almost all oceans except for the Arctic. They usually move around depending on the seasons, going to places with a lot of food in the summer and breeding in warmer waters in the winter. However, some blue whales in certain areas might not travel at all. The details about where they go and how they move aren't well known, but in general, they go where there is a lot of krill, their main food. In the North Atlantic Ocean, you can find them from warm areas to the colder Greenland Sea. Blue whales have been seen near eastern Canada and in the waters off the eastern United States. On the west coast of the United States, blue whales in the eastern North Pacific 
likely spend winters near Mexico and Central America. In the summer, they probably eat in areas like the U.S., West Coast, and sometimes in the Gulf of Alaska and Central North Pacific. Blue whales with baby calves are often seen in the Gulf of California from December to March. This place is thought to be important for them to have babies and take care of them. To clear up the first misunderstanding, it's important to know that blue whales aren't fish. Unlike fish, these marine mammals breathe air with lungs and give birth to live babies, just like humans and other mammals. This makes them more like elephants and dolphins than fish. Although dolphins and whales share some similarities, but they are not the same. Blue whales are part of diverse families, each with its own unique features. For instance, baleen whales, like the blue whale, use baleen plates to filter feed, while toothed whales, like killer whales, use teeth to hunt. This variety showcases the richness of the whale family. While the blue whale is indeed enormous, not all whales are that big. Some, like the dwarf sperm whale, are much smaller, showing a wide range of sizes within the whale world. Contrary to the idea that blue whales are quiet, they are quite chatty. Blue whales communicate using clicks, whistles, and songs. The humpback whale, for example, produces haunting melodies that can be heard over long distances, revealing the complexity of their language. Blue whales are not limited to cold waters. They adapt to various environments, from the Arctic to tropical waters. Some, like the gray whale, even embark on impressive migrations, showcasing their ability to thrive in different places. Far from being a single species, there are over 90 different species of whales. Each has its own behaviors, appearances, and roles in the ecosystem, highlighting the rich diversity of ocean life. Whales don't eat everything in sight. Some, like killer whales, are apex predators, while others, like blue whales, feed on plankton using their baleen plates to filter large quantities. Contrary to the belief that blue whales are dangerous, interactions with humans are usually marked by curiosity and caution. Instances of aggression towards humans are extremely rare, emphasizing the peaceful nature of these creatures. The idea that blue whales have short lives is incorrect. Many whale species can live for several decades, with some, like the bowhead whale, reaching lifespans exceeding 200 years, showcasing their remarkable resilience. Unfortunately, the belief that blue whales are everywhere is not true. Many whale populations have declined significantly due to factors like hunting, pollution, and habitat loss. Conservation efforts are crucial to ensure the survival of these magnificent creatures. As ambassadors of the sea, these beautiful creatures continue to captivate our hearts and minds, reminding us of the importance of conservation efforts to ensure their survival. For more videos like this, join our family by subscribing to the Nautical Depths, and let's explore the legends, truths, and information about the mighty ocean.